Hi, I'm Rob Cram, and today we're taking a speculative look at some games that will likely have a revised version for next-gen consoles, rather than waiting for the next game in the series, especially if new consoles are released this year, as many are speculating. Forget the yearly multi-format releases like Call of Duty and Assassin's Creed and FIFA, because it's likely by the time new consoles roll out, they will already have new games to showcase. But about the games that take years to develop, it makes sense to re-release the current versions for next-gen audiences, perhaps with a few extras thrown in for good measure to act as an enticement for those who already own current-gen versions. What would be great business is if those gamers who already own current-gen versions decide to purchase their next-gen counterparts, they are offered some sort of discount or even the upgrade for free. Wishful thinking may be, let's have a look at those games. Crisis 3 EA will be releasing new games such as the next-gen FIFA and Battlefield, but let's not forget Crytek's efforts with the already next-gen looking Crisis 3, which is fantastic on PCs at the moment if you've played the beta. It makes sense to include Xbox Next and PS4 gamers into the fold with such a cracking looking showcase game. It certainly won't be out of date by the time they come round. Tomb Raider also looks great on current gen consoles, but will look much better on the PC, and therefore makes sense to bring this established franchise to next gen audiences right out the gate, rather than wait several years for a new game. Crystal Dynamics could spend the remaining part of this year after the game's initial release working on new content for the new version. Bioshock Infinite has been a game filled with delays but will undoubtedly be worth the wait and with not long to go Irrational Games has time to tweak the PC version for next gen consoles. With a new Bioshock years away no doubt, revised version does make sense. Rockstar's big release slipping to September GTA 5 already suggests there could be a next gen version especially as there's no news on the PC version as yet. It's very possible that Xbox Next and PS4 will get their own versions of this gargantuan game and fans will most likely not need the much persuasion to buy the game again several months after the current gen version, especially if it's packed with extra episodes. Metal Gear Ground Zeroes Kojima's game already has tongues wagging as to whether the game will be next gen, but we've been led to believe the game and its side game Phantom Pain are running on current gen systems. With the game's release date still very secret, it's possible these games will have more than one version. Okay, well that's food for thought. I'm Rob Cram. Thanks for watching.